Hi folks and welcome back to Math with Captain Rod. I'm making this video here to uh, just describe where the equation for a circle comes from. So I went ahead and, and wrote it out. Here's the equation for a circle in standard form. And circles have a very important uh, property. They have a center to them. And the center of the circle that I've drawn here is, is uh, pretty well right there. Now I put a dot here. This is dot is actually not part of the graph. It's a like it's not a point that satisfies the equation of a circle, but it's an important uh, uh, property of any circle where the center is. So in general, the coordinates of the center are usually called h and k. Now why h and k? I don't know, but most books I use use these or that I've seen use these values to represent the center of a circle. Now the one I've actually drawn, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, this is actually the point six two for this identical circle. But you know, imagine we don't know that h and k, this is true no matter where the circle is. Circle can be can be anywhere in the plane here. The way that the equation um, where the equation comes from, I guess I should say, is Pythagorean theorem. If I pick some point on the circle, like maybe right here, where this is a coordinate on the circle, coordinates x, y, that's true anywhere on the circle, no matter where it's at. The equation is coming from the fact that this distance right here is equal, to, well, that distance squared is equal to this distance squared plus this distance squared. If you've seen my uh, uh, previous video on how to calculate the distance between two points, uh, that should be familiar. I'm going to go back and redraw those a little better. This distance and this distance. This horizontal distance, that first one, you can always find the difference between, or these horizontal distances by taking the difference between the x values. So that's equal to x minus h. Well, let's write that in black. x minus h. And then this distance you can get by taking the difference between the y values. So that's equal to y minus k. And when you apply Pythagorean theorem, you then get x minus h, that's this horizontal distance, squared, plus y minus k, there's our other leg, squared, is equal to this distance in red, which is what's called the radius of the circle. The distance from the center to any point on the circle is referred to as the radius. <clears throat> so that's what that value is there. So uh, the point of the video is just to describe where the equation for a circle comes from. And it comes from um, using Pythagorean theorem to <clears throat> relate any point x, y to the center. So I hope that this video helps you understand that. Have a great day.